My name is Colin Hutchison, the designer and lead engineer of the Electron Aero E75, an all-electric tandem two-seat aircraft designed for the home-built market. Welcome back to the Mojo Grip My Plane Showcase. Today we're checking out an aircraft that is simply revolutionary. An all-electric two-place sport plane, the Electron E75. There are some pretty impressive all-electric aircraft that are already in the market today, but this is bound to set the bar just a bit higher. The Electron will be powered by an all-electric motor, 7 to 5 kilowatts, with a ground-adjustable three-blade prop. And with that, you've got about two and a half hours worth of flight time, but more importantly is the speed. When you think about the electric aircraft we currently have in the market today, the Pippa Show Trainer may come to mind. And with that, you're not really going anywhere fast. You've got maybe an hour worth of endurance, but with the Electron, you've got double the time and you're going much faster at 130 knots. That's equivalent to about 150 miles per hour. The Electron E75 will likely be categorized as a light sport aircraft given there are no retractable landing gear. If you do get a retractable landing gear, then chances are you're no longer in the light sport category. In Europe maybe, but in the US market, you'd have to get a different certification for the aircraft. As is currently, the Electron is set to come out as a home-built kit, which means you'd have to buy the kit, buy your engine, and put the plane together. So as an experimental aircraft, you will have more option to add or take away from the aircraft. And chances are, this aircraft will also be equipped with a ballistic parachute as an option. The Electron has two tandem seats, so one up front and one behind, and the range on this aircraft is about 200 miles. So this is more of a quick hop plane, you're not going anywhere far with it. But a great mission this aircraft will serve is rather training, because the cost to operate an electric airplane per hour will be pennies on the dollar compared to a legacy aircraft. As far as the price, nothing has been set yet, but we're likely looking at $150,000 to $200,000 for this airplane. <laughs> 